welcome to my very first tutorial uh, we're going to be doing um, the mouse coordinate uh, node sorry about the poor sound quality my machine is making a lot of noise uh, so before we, uh, wasting a lot of time let's get straight to it so basically you start a new blender uh, you start a new blender file um, then we're going to be using the, the original uh, box that uh, blender has um, so firstly you, uh, you also need a ground plane just to make it uh, a bit visually uh, good um, so yeah I, I also need to put it at the bottom so it just looks good like that um, uh, don't forget to save the, the, the file I just saved it on um, on the desktop you just use any 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 name it's okay um so now uh we want to position the camera so i just uh, try to position the camera in such a way that uh, you don't see the background you only see the ground plane all right um let's just choose any color um i chose red very vivid color um then now um i'm still thinking how this not work i'm still figuring it out though um i'm still new to blender 2.8 okay now let's move on to the actual nodes uh, how then you um add the mouse coordinate node um how then you use the the mouse coordinate node um so that's where you put the traits you uh, select nodes uh then you select the the node uh, the node name the group um not so sure what it's called <laughs> all right so now you add the on update um on update node so that each and every frame it's a, it it triggers the, the 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 node sequence so uh then you set uh, you 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 add the set location node uh, this is going to determine the, the actual location where the mouse is then you add a, a mouse coordinate node then after that you add the then you add the vector coordinate uh, node this is responsible for reducing the sensitivity of the mouse then after that you add the vector node uh, this is just uh, how to you display the the, the z axis or x y axis as well um then once you put in that number i think that's the one that i used uh that was, was what uh worked uh, so th then you put the uh, translate to object node uh, the tree will be now complete one when you do this um let's just uh, find a way to test it out then see if this way this is working um still looking for it there you go i don't know why it's starting in the corner there let me put it in in full screen so that you can see um, nothing is happening ah, le let's correct that let's correct that um, i think the video recording uh, software that i'm using wasn't able to show that uh, but I'll, I'll definitely edit in edit in um, the, the video so that you show i'll show you how 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 i was able to to record that then after that you then put the the show or sh uh, show mouse uh, node then the in it so that you, you can see you can then toggle uh, show mouse or uh, not to show the mouse so basically that's it that's how you use the mouse coordinate um, mouse coordinate node so when you then use the mouse the object will, uh, will follow so if you want to make a game that's you that utilizes the that utilizes the that function put your comments below so that also we can then help each other um, i'll value your comments i'll read each and every one one of them also um, put any tutorial that you also want me to try in the future or any tutorial that you see is useful um, to the community thank you for watching